Hi guys, Jake here from Weefleck. Going to be talking about Sunline today. We just want to cover a bit about the braid and... Oh. Stressing! Anyone else want to do it? Not really? <laughs> Hi guys, and welcome to Weefleck Fishing. It's Jake here and today we're going to be talking about Sunline. Now we're just going to be going through a bit of the construction side of things and just the... Oh, bruh. Sunline. Oh, bruh. 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 Where you would use it in the uh, constructions of it and just what, what sizes and so this is super thin stuff. Now the good thing about having so such a th such a thin thun thun line. This is <laughs> through the sunline rage. Just want to cover for the people. Just want to cover for the people. If we don't have them all, but that head. Yep, uh, ticky ticky. Well, now we'll start off with a rockfish. This is eight pound braid, thickness 0.01. Oh, 0.04, you f. This one. Why do I go that much? You know, I'm struggling here, boys. Come on, give us a hand. I can go into the physics of like how resistance and drag of the water. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Surface area. Right, just go with what you All right, now we'll start off with the PE. The PE is the thinnest in the Sunline range. It's 0.4 of a millimetre, and it's 20% thinner than the, the Super PE range. Did you just call this to me? That's the rockfish. Ah. Oh. You just want to get into plastics and you're looking into what braids to be... Too much info. <laughs> or was that alright? 